51 days, 51 recipes, and this is day five. If y'all see the food processor or this mother you know shit about to get real. We're cooking our way through Come Fix You a Plate, food you'll actually cook, and today we're making CJ's Grown Up Brownies. Now almost everything I cook I know by heart, but this one, strap in. We're gonna need the book. Three sticks of butter in a saucepan. You're gonna put this on the stove and melt it until the butter starts to simmer. Y'all already know, I love me some challenge, and I'm using unsalted today. While that's heating up on the stove, we're gonna chop up our chocolate. I've got two three and a half ounce bars of 85% dark chocolate. Use whatever kind of dark chocolate you like. And I've got a 4.4 ounce bar of milk chocolate. The butter is bubbling. So it's gonna go right on top of our chocolate. We're just gonna set this to the side. Now for the stand mixer. We're gonna use the whisk attachment. Oh I missed a step. To this, we're gonna add some espresso powder. Now CJ says a tablespoon, but I'm the one making them today, so I want two. Now, we're doing two cups of white sugar, one cup of dark brown sugar. Damn, it was supposed to be half a cup of dark brown sugar. See, this is why y'all don't see me baking. I'm not a scientist. A tablespoon of vanilla. Yeah, just put the whole thing in. Two teaspoons of salt. I can't find my baking powder. Uh, we're going to the store. Dollar General coming in clutch. And daddy got him a little afternoon treat. Okay, half a teaspoon of baking powder and seven eggs. We're gonna start it out on low for a minute or two. And now we're gonna crank the up on high and it's gonna go for 10 minutes. Now stir up your chocolate and butter mixture. Make sure it's nice and smooth. It's been 10 minutes. We're gonna slowly pour this into the mixer. Here, look at it. I let it go just a few more minutes until it was fully incorporated. Now we're gonna sift a cup of all-purpose flour together with a half a cup of Dutch processed cocoa powder. If I was a smart man, I'd have done this while that mixer was going. We're gonna gently fold in this flour and cocoa powder into our batter mixture, whatever the f Do this just until it's mixed. You don't wanna over mix this part. We've got a nine by 13 pan, greased. We're gonna put parchment paper in it. Look, crinkle it all up like this, and that's gonna help it lay flat, mostly. Now in goes our batter. 350 degree oven for 20 to 25 minutes. Brownies have been cooking for 25 minutes. I'm gonna put a towel here doubled up on a cutting board. Now we're gonna bang this pan and craft this crust on the top. Can you see that? It may not crack all the way across. That's okay, just don't overdo it. Back in the oven for another 20 minutes. I know I'm wearing a different shirt, but I'm filming four different recipes today. So I'm doing costume changes and I'm in between. Been out of the oven for about 15 minutes. We're about to pick them up and put them on a wire rack to finish cooling off. Oh, look at that. That dark chocolate and that extra coffee. I know y'all's asses thought grown up brownies meant something else. What was in these brownies? I'm freaking out, bro. Y'all come fix you one of these. 